countdown underway. And our final qualification match has begun here at SimChamps 2020. Similar starting strategy for both alliances. One robot grabbing the power cells off the initiation line while their partners go into the trenches and their rendezvous points. Red Alliance capitally much capitalizing much better on the power cells they're able to collect. They got off to an early 78 to 52 lead at the end of the autonomous period. And now with our driver controlled scoring period underway, we're seeing robots racing back to loading zones to get ready to score once again. Two robots scoring for the Red Alliance, one for blue. Shaq able to empty off their hopper for the Red Alliance. Elfman and Nick L now trying to score simultaneously. That leads to a lot of power cells going into the power ports, but it usually means not many making it into the inner port. Every power cell scored in the outer port worth two points apiece, each one in the inner port worth three. Logan4476 and Devadio scoring for the Blue Alliance at the same time. Our two alliances neck and neck while well, Red started out with the lead. Blue has now taken that lead right on back. But Red is close behind and taking it right back from them as soon as I speak. 70 seconds remaining in the match. Elfman playing some quick defense, hitting at Jam 2145, but then backing off to grab power cells from the loading zone. All six robots on one side of the field, leading some traffic jams, slowing robots down. That's good news for the Blue Alliance. It means that their lead is held for just a little bit longer and could help them strategically in the final minute of the match. T minus 45. Contact between Nick L and Jam2145. Nick L backs off before they respawn. Tied 202 points apiece. But Blue quickly breaks that tie and takes the lead right on back as we enter our end game period. Now we've got a lot of robots on the Red Alliance side of the field. Nickel trying to grab rebounded power cells off of the playing field ground before firing them into what appears to be the inner port of the Red Alliance side of the field. Blue Alliance with only a three point lead tied with five seconds to go. 271 points per alliance that's coming down to the robots that can get themselves up in the final moments of the match. It looks like all six robots may have been able to do it. We'll have to wait for the end game scores to come on up. Final results incoming. This one's going to the Red Alliance 331 to 316. Red Alliance walking home with three ranking points, two from their win and one from shield generator operational status by scoring 65 or greater points in endgame. Blue Alliance not going home empty handed. They earn a bonus ranking point by scoring greater than 90 power cells that right there the end of our qualification round meaning our alliance selection will be starting momentarily just like our tournament director nick shared with us before the match thanks for watching if you want more fun content be sure to subscribe and ring the bell to be notified about our latest videos you can also directly help support fun by visiting our patreon at patreon.com forward slash first updates now or by subscribing at twitch.tv forward slash first updates now Thanks to all of our co-executive producers on Patreon and Tier 2 Plus subscribers on Twitch, keeping fun loud, live, and independent.